Apple, Google, and Amazon are working together so soon. Everything in your smart home will be able to talk to everything else thanks to the Matter Protocol, a uniform standard that aims to revolutionize and guarantee a secure connection between your smart home devices. Anyone who buys a smart home device in the future no longer will have to worry about whether it can be integrated into the Apple Home Kit, whether voice control works with Alexa, or whether the connection to Google Nest's Hub 2 test is possible. If it works with Matter, it works with everything, at least in theory. So what is Matter and what does it actually do? Will it work on old devices too? And when will it be launched? Well, we'll answer all these questions and more in today's video, so stay tuned. First up, what is Matter? Apple, Amazon, Google, Ikea, Signify, and more well-known tech companies formed what is currently known as the Zigbee Alliance or the Connectivity Standards Alliance. The common goal was and is to create universal and open standards for the Internet of Things. With the Zigbee standard, smart devices were able to set up a mesh network for the first time and communicate with one another over long distances in an energy-saving manner. The radio protocol has been further developed over the years and is considered to be safer, faster, and more reliable than WLAN or Bluetooth Low Energy. In this country, Zigbee is primarily known to users of smart light sources such as the Philips Hue bulbs. At the beginning of May this year, the Zigbee Alliance announced that it was renamed the Connectivity Standards Alliance, or CSA. At the same time, the new smart home standard, Matter, was officially presented, which was previously developed under the project name Connected Home Over IP, or CHIP for short. The Connectivity Standards Alliance currently has more than 180 companies. In addition to those already mentioned, Hawaii, IKEA, Signify, Texas Instruments, and SmartThings also belong to the CSA. So what does Matter do better? With Matter, the CSA wants to introduce a new unifying industry standard for the networking of smart home devices. It should offer reliable and secure connectivity and ensure that all supported devices and systems from all manufacturers can harmonize with one another, now and in the future. Matter uses the Internet Protocol, or IP, for communication between the devices. According to the CSA, the first specification supports the transmission standards Ethernet 802.3, Wi-Fi 802.11, Thread 802.15.4, and Bluetooth Low Energy. The latter should be used primarily for the initial setup of the devices, as is already common practice with many devices today. Matter will coexist with existing wireless protocols such as Thread or Zigbee. So can you use Alexa, Siri, or Google's Assistant with Matter? Here the answer is definitely yes. Existing smart home systems such as HomeKit or Amazon's Alexa are all supported and continue to serve as the control center in your smart home. Matter itself only ensures stable and universal communication. Figuratively speaking, it provides a uniform road network and regulates traffic for all compatible devices. Google has already announced in a blog post that it will automatically make all current Nest devices Matter compatible with an update. The new Nest thermostat will be controllable for the first time from platforms from other manufacturers. Android will also be supporting Matter. This is intended to facilitate operation via smartphones. There should be no uniform user interface or control app. For users of Alexa, HomeKit, or the Google Assistant, there would not be much change at first glance. However, it no longer matters which system you use and you can easily switch at any time. In other words, Matter devices can be integrated into several smart home systems at the same time. If you prefer HomeKit yourself, another resident can still control the same devices at the same time via Amazon's Alexa, and that's one of the major features of Matter compared to other smart home standards. So what do you have to look out for when buying new devices? When buying smart light bulbs, thermostats, or motion sensors, users will only have to check whether the products are compatible with Matter. Amazon's Alexa, Apple's HomeKit, Google's Nest, or other smart home systems can then easily access it. The certificates, works with Alexa, or works with Apple HomeKit, will be superfluous in the future. It remains to be seen whether they will still appear on the packaging or just use the Matter symbol. Compatible smart home devices can be controlled from all different ecosystems thanks to Matter. For example, if a smart home has a HomePod Mini with Apple's HomeKit, an Amazon Echo smart speaker, 
or a Google Nest Hub, a smart outdoor camera can still be integrated into all three systems at the same time. The camera could therefore execute commands and automatisms from Siri, Alexa, and Google's Assistant at the same time. To avoid complications, the last command received will always apply. Communication via Matter should be possible locally even without an internet connection. So will you need another hub for Matter? As of right now, no additional hub will be required for Matter. Instead, the devices should communicate directly with each other. Devices, integrated via Wi-Fi and LAN, are also integrated directly into your home network. In the case of thread-capable devices, so-called border routers bridge the gap in the home network. A border router can currently be a HomePod Mini or Apple TV from 2021, but Nanoleaf has already announced that the elements and shape controllers will function as border routers in the future. Will you have to look out for the terms Work with HomeKit in the future? In the long term, all Matter devices should be controllable via Apple's Home app. However, there will also be HomeKit-specific devices such as HomeKit secure video cameras or their newly introduced door locks with home keys. You will also have to look out for the Works with HomeKit logo in the future. However, Matter's support is sufficient for simple devices such as adapter plugs. Can Matter be used with old devices? It's currently not yet certain whether all current smart home devices will really be compatible with Matter. Although the Zigbee Alliance announced back in the days of CHIP that existing devices and systems should continue to work with the new standard, in the end this decision will lie with the manufacturer and the technical feasibility of their respective devices themselves. It's likely that bridge-based systems in particular will receive a corresponding software update. Here, the control center would only have to be adapted to the Matter specifications. The lights, door locks, or motion sensors connected to it could then continue to work with other standards such as Zigbee. Philips Hue has already announced this approach, and Amazon will also prepare existing Echo devices for Matter with a software update. The company announced this at the Alexa Live 2021 developer conference. According to its own information, Amazon will update most of the Echo and Echo Dot devices, as well as Echo Studio, Flex, Plus, and Show devices. According to US media, only the first generation Echo and Echo Dot smart speakers and the Echo Tap portable Alexa Bluetooth speaker, which has never really been released in this country, are left out. For new developments, however, manufacturers should be happy to rely on Matter. After all, they no longer have to adapt their products separately to the various systems such as HomeKit, Alexa, or Assistant. So what does Matter mean for the future of smart homes? It's really not that easy to predict. However, it looks like Matter will break down the current boundaries that exist in many smart device ecosystems. For smart homeowners, this means that making smart home product decisions will require less research and more plug-and-play products will be available. This is great news for some. Matter's announcement delivers what many consumers have long requested in the smart home industry, unification. With Apple, Amazon, and Google on board, it looks like the industry is finally listening. So finally, when will Matter be launched? Anyone waiting for the uniform Matter standard in the smart home sector will have to be patient. This project, which Google, Apple, Samsung, and Amazon are currently working on, among others, will be postponed to 2022. This was announced by President and CEO of the Connectivity Standard Alliance, Torben Richardson. The ambitious plans to work out a common protocol with the new Matter Smart Home Connectivity Standard will therefore be given a new schedule. It's not the first time that there's been a postponement because the starting shot was originally supposed to be given this year. But there were many delays in 2020 due to the Corona crisis. The implementation of the Universal Standard can now realistically start in the second half of 2022, according to Richardson. Now that we finally come to the end of our video, what's your guys' opinion about Matter? Do you think it really matters? Let us know your thoughts down in the comments section below. If you want to see more interesting videos like this one, just subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell. Thanks so much for watching, and I really hope to see you again next time.